you know that you can travel all over the world without ever leaving your seat? That's right. France, Italy, Brazil, Africa, you name it, literally, the sky is the limit. So today I will be serving as your virtual travel agent as we travel to a land far, far away. Google Earth is the world's most detailed globe. You can discover cities around the world. You can dive into the world's deepest canyons, and you can climb the tallest mountains. Let's get ready to launch Google Earth. Okay, welcome on board everyone. We are getting ready to start our learning adventure. We're venturing out to several educational headquarters. So, buckle your seatbelts, let's get ready. First up, let's fly out to the Georgia Public Broadcasting for the Georgia Home Classroom Project. Georgia Public Broadcasting is located in Atlanta, Georgia. GPB has partnered with our Georgia Department of Education to offer educational broadcast programming and accompany digital resources that adhere to our Georgia standards of excellence. As you notice, the resources are from pre-K all the way into 12th grade. For example, this is fourth grade English language arts resources. And so here's a list of resources that's available and you'll notice the title, you'll notice the source, the resource type, they have videos, they have handouts, they have assessments and quizzes. You'll notice the skill, the specific skill that is to be addressed as well as the Georgia standard. Another resource that's available is Camp PBS Kids. This is offered by PBS Learning Media as well as Georgia Public Broadcasting. This is full of ideas and strategies, charts and handouts and activities and games that families can do together. There's also an opportunity for you to sign up for a daily newsletter to receive information straight to your inbox. Okay, next we'll head out to the Georgia Statewide After School Network where they had a 50 state collaboration to develop the ultimate summer activity guide. what you can expect is 150 activities and challenges. Here's an example of Unit 1 entitled, Who Am I? Um, you can use this in person or virtual instruction or hybrid of both. Or if you're the person that kind of just like, you know, just to send out take home packets, you can do that as well. Um, they have materials, as it says here, for professional development, webinars, guides, feedback forms, you name it. And so let's take a closer look at an example. So again, here's the Who Am I guide. And it gives you step-by-step, -step, you know, the supplies you need, um, you know, gives you a script, steps, questions for discussion, just to reinforce learning. Look at here, a photo, scavenger hunt. So there's a lot of great little crafts and hands-on projects. We know that children love it when it's fun and when it's engaging. From the Georgia After School Network, we'll then head over to Get Georgia Reading. Get Georgia Reading is also located in Atlanta, Georgia. Get Georgia Reading is offering resources for parents all summer long. They're providing information for meal assistance as well as safety tips including a comprehensive list of learning resources. For starters, Write by Text is a free service that's providing activities, games, resources right to the parent's smartphones. This information is provided for all parents and caregivers. And the great thing is that information can be received in English as well as Spanish. And although some of the resources are catered to the state of Georgia, it most certainly may be accessed as well as adapted for other areas as well. The Georgia Aquarium lets the animals come to you. 
That's right, you can enjoy at home learning with sea animals from the aquarium. You can participate in daily and weekly live streams, download lesson plans and resources. Hey, you can even take a live look at the aquarium right now and look at their webcams. There's also a learning series available from their education staff, 18 episodes thus far, very good content. It's for animal facts, as well as take a look at some of their detailed lesson plans. Okay, from Get Georgia Reading, we're now heading over to Discovery Education for the Discovery Education Experience located in Charlotte, North Carolina. The Discovery Education Experience is keeping you connected with high quality content, ready to use digital lessons, creative collaboration tools, practical professional learning resources, and so much more. Parents can even check out a new resource called the Daily DE for meaningful and engaging learning activities to do at home with their children. You will notice that each day has its own theme, M and STEM Mondays. Get Techie with it Tuesday. Workout Wednesday. Thoughtful Thursday. And then we all love, of course, Field Trip Friday. Also, Discovery Education has partnered to offer Science at Home, a series of fun educational science experiments for students ages 6 and 12. Experiments are conducted by real life scientists in their homes using common household items that are designed to reinforce core scientific principles. Now we're heading over to Scholastic Corporation. Scholastic is located in New York, New York. Similar to Discovery Education, Scholastic features day-to-day -day projects that keep families reading, thinking, and growing. Simply choose from a grade level, as displayed below, pre-K through ninth grade, to explore their collection of activities. Let's take a look at grades six through ninth. As you see, the weeks are reflected, and each week showcases different activities each day of the week. For example, let's take a look at day one. Day one features a team changing how the world views disabilities and celebrating differences. After their reading journey, they can simply head over to the daily reading quest, which features several different corresponding activities, games, documents, in order to explore creativity and reinforce learning. Our final destination is on to Google. The Googleplex is located in Mountain View, California. A similar theme, Teach From Home, is being presented by Google. Google is giving teachers and families the tools and tips they need to help students keep learning. They offer a wealth of resources. For example, for families, they can find information about technology their child needs in order to use for school, how to manage your child's technology use, and how to help keep them safe online. Where can they find more content to support their child's learning? And lastly, how can they communicate with their child's school? And what if they speak a different language? All these resources are free and available from their website.
for example, let's take a look at one of the coding activities that parents can access from home. So here is fun coding activities. We know coding is very big now with a lot of the kids. They really love to create their own websites and do all kind of fun animations. And this resource is no exception. For example, they can code their own superhero. This resource, Code Your Hero, offers two activities for a period of one to two hours of fun coding games. Students can learn about computer science as well as the free program Scratch. But all of these activities, and again, all of the resources that was discussed today are absolutely free. And a lot of them, you don't even have to subscribe at all. It's all available and free to you. All right, so that concludes our learning adventure, ladies and gentlemen. We hope you enjoyed your learning flight. Until next time.